What if the boundary between life and death revealed the secrets of our existence? Discover stories of those who ventured beyond the veil, where the law of attraction unfolds in the afterlife. From transformative insights to profound realizations, hear firsthand how thoughts shape our reality beyond this world. Join us as we explore the mysterious intersection of near-death experiences and the universal power of attraction. Uncover the lessons learned in the space between life and death, and how they can inspire us to live more consciously. Subscribe and journey with us into the heart of existence. Your perception of life and death may never be the same. Welcome to Quantum Mind. For those familiar with near-death experiences, or NDEs, you'll recognize the profound impact these encounters have on those who've brushed with the beyond. Characterized by out-of-body experiences, journeys through tunnels towards a light, profound meetings with spiritual entities or past loved ones and life-altering life reviews, NDEs transcend mere medical phenomena. They are transformative, often reshaping survivors' outlooks on life, death, and the interconnectivity of all things. Many emerge from NDEs with a profound appreciation for love and relationships, a diminished fear of death, and a strengthened belief in an afterlife. Notably, some return with an enhanced spiritual understanding, often aligning with principles like the law of attraction. It's this transformation and newfound perspective that underscore the depth and significance of NDEs in understanding our existence and the universe at large. Building on our understanding of NDEs, let's delve deeper into a concept that many of you may be already acquainted with, the Law of Attraction. This principle, both straightforward and profound, posits that our thoughts have the magnetic power to shape our reality. Essentially, it operates on the premise that, like attracts like, positive thoughts lead to positive outcomes, while negative thoughts can summon adverse experiences. This concept isn't just a modern self-help phenomenon, it's woven through the fabric of various spiritual traditions and philosophies throughout history, often heralded as a universal truth that underscores our interconnectedness with the cosmos. It emphasizes our role as co-creators of our destiny, suggesting a powerful synergy between our inner thoughts and the external world. With this in mind, the Law of Attraction offers a compelling lens through which to interpret the transformative insights gained from NDEs. With these concepts in mind, we can now explore some unique case studies. As we delve into these narratives, remember, each is a personal journey that reveals the potential intersections between near-death experiences and the law of attraction. These stories are not just about the moment of facing death, but also about the transformational insights gained and the profound shifts in understanding the nature of reality. They highlight how thoughts have the power to shape our experiences, not only in our everyday lives but potentially beyond. The spiritual dimension, as described by those who have had near-death experiences, gives us a glimpse into the co-creative power we may hold. These experiences offer a profound look into the possible intersections of NDEs and the Law of Attraction. In our exploration of the profound impacts of near-death experiences NDEs, on individuals' beliefs in the Law of Attraction, we turn to an enlightening case study highlighted in the writings of Morella Taylor. Taylor's blog delves into the intricate relationship between NDEs and the universal principles governing our existence, particularly through the lens of the Law of Attraction. This case revolves around an individual whose quest for understanding the mysteries of life and the afterlife was sparked by an immersive journey into various Netflix documentaries on mediumship, as well as insightful readings, including those on life between lives. Driven by an innate curiosity about the afterlife and its implications for living, this person found themselves profoundly affected by narratives of others who had teetered on the edge of death or communicated with spirits beyond. These stories weren't just tales of survival or grief, they were windows into a world where consciousness persists beyond the physical, where messages from the deceased offer both solace and insight. Among these narratives one particularly resonated, a heartfelt connection with a deceased grandfather which not only reaffirmed the continuity of consciousness but also illuminated the intricate ways our thoughts and the universe intertwine. The crux of this exploration led to an epiphany about the law of attraction, the idea that our thoughts, whether imbued with hope or fear, actively shape the tapestry of our lives. This wasn't just theoretical, it was experiential. 
a truth lived and felt. The individual began to see their life as a canvas, where mastering the law of attraction could be the brush in hand, painting their existence with the colors of their thoughts. This realization was not born in isolation, it was the culmination of engaging deeply with the stories of those who had glimpsed beyond the veil through their NDEs. What emerged from this journey was a transformative understanding, the power of our thoughts extends far beyond the confines of our physical existence. This individual witnessed the potential of thoughts to manifest reality, influenced by the testimonies of those who had navigated the space between life and death. Through their engagement with the concept of NDEs and the stories of profound encounters in the afterlife, they grasped a more profound appreciation for the law of attraction. They saw it not merely as a spiritual or metaphysical theory, but as a living, breathing truth that had tangible impacts on their perception of life and its overarching purpose. This case study, as presented by Taylor, underscores a pivotal insight, the transformative power of our thoughts and the undeniable link between the experiences of those who have faced death and the principles of the law of attraction. It highlights a journey of personal evolution, where understanding the continuity of consciousness and embracing the law of attraction opens new avenues for perceiving life's meaning and our role within it. Through this narrative, we're invited to consider how our own experiences and beliefs can intertwine, leading us to a richer, more nuanced understanding of existence itself. Our subsequent exploration takes us into the archives of the Near-Death Experience Research Foundation NDRRF, a pivotal entity in the realm of NDE scholarship. Through its extensive collection of first-hand accounts, NDRF provides unparalleled insights into the enigmatic nature of near-death experiences and their connection to the law of attraction. Among the multitude of narratives one story stands out, shedding light on the profound intersection between these experiences and the power of thought. Consider the case of Jordan, a man who after a severe car accident found himself in an NDE state where he encountered a realm of existence both boundless and void. Jordan described experiencing an overwhelming sense of unity, a state where the dichotomy of everything and nothing coalesced into a singular experience of oneness. This sensation, as Jordan relayed, seemed to mirror the principles of the law of attraction, where the universe and the self are not separate but one and the same. In this state, time lost its linearity, echoing the law of attraction's assertion that our thoughts can transcend temporal boundaries to shape our reality. Jordan's experience illuminates the concept of manifestation within the framework of an NDE. He recounted how his thoughts and desires, even those previously deemed unattainable, began manifesting with vivid clarity. This realization came with the profound understanding that our consciousness, our thoughts and feelings, play a direct role in sculpting our experiences. It was as if the veil between thought and reality had been lifted, revealing the intrinsic power of belief and intention. Moreover, Jordan's narrative emphasizes the theme of co-creation, a recurring motif in NDE accounts. He described feeling an innate responsibility for the reality he was experiencing, suggesting a symbiotic relationship between his consciousness and the fabric of existence. This insight reflects a cornerstone belief of the law of attraction, that we are not merely passive observers, but active participants in the creation of our reality. Jordan's journey through his NDE provided him with a glimpse into the potent influence of his thoughts and beliefs, an influence that appeared to extend beyond the physical realm. Upon returning to his physical body, Jordan felt empowered by the knowledge that the law of attraction operates not just in life as we know it, but could also play a pivotal role in the experiences we encounter beyond. This case study, derived from the meticulous research of NDRF, offers compelling evidence of the manifestation potential during NDEs. It invites us to ponder the far-reaching implications of the law of attraction, suggesting that its principles may not only guide us in our current existence but also in the realms beyond. In this exploration of spiritism and its connection to near-death experiences NDEs, we encounter the story of Elena, a case that vividly illustrates the principles of reincarnation and the profound spiritual lessons NDEs can impart. Spiritism, as conceptualized by Allan Kardec in the 19th century, views life on Earth as a series of lessons designed to refine the soul across successive incarnations. This framework provides a rich context for understanding the transformative nature of NDEs, which often feature deeply spiritual encounters and revelations about the journey of the soul. 
Elena's experience, as documented by the Near-Death Experience Research Foundation NDRF, offers compelling insights into these concepts. During a critical surgery, Elena found herself in an ethereal realm where she was greeted by spirits and deceased loved ones who conveyed messages of love, forgiveness, and the importance of her life's decisions. This encounter underscored the spiritist belief in the continuous evolution of the soul and the significance of each life as a step towards spiritual enlightenment. One of the most striking aspects of Elena's NDE was her interaction with a being of light, who imparted wisdom about the cyclical nature of existence and the soul's progression through various lives. This being emphasized that the thoughts and actions Elena chose in her earthly life had a direct impact on her soul's journey echoing the law of attraction's premise that our innermost thoughts and desires manifest in our reality. This message was not only relevant for Elena's current life, but also offered a broader perspective on the role of reincarnation in shaping the soul's destiny. By embracing the principles of love, justice and forgiveness, Elena was informed that she could influence the trajectory of her soul's evolution, potentially hastening its progress towards ultimate purity and enlightenment. Elena's account, rich with spiritual lessons and insights, serves as a powerful example of the interconnectedness between NDEs, the law of attraction, and the philosophy of spiritism. Her experience reveals the intricate ways in which our current thoughts and deeds can resonate through our spiritual journey, influencing not just our present existence but our future incarnations as well. Through this case study we gain a deeper appreciation for the spiritual dimensions explored in NDEs and their alignment with the teachings of spiritism. It reminds us of the profound impact our lives have on our soul's evolution and the cosmic significance of our every thought and action. As we delve into these narratives, we are invited to reflect on the eternal nature of our being and the transformative power of love and intention in our quest for spiritual growth. So, what can we glean from these fascinating case studies? We've journeyed through the enigmatic realm of near-death experiences, explored the potent law of attraction, and delved into personal accounts that bridge the two. These stories beckon us to ponder on the profound questions of life, death, and the power that our thoughts wield. Perhaps these narratives challenge us to reimagine the boundaries of our own reality. They invite us to question, what if our consciousness is not confined to the physical realm? What if we are co-creators of our reality, shaping it with our thoughts and intentions? These questions, while daunting, can unlock new perspectives about our existence and purpose. As we conclude this journey, remember the exploration does not end here. You carry the torch forward, Reflect on your own beliefs, perceptions, and the untapped power of your thoughts. How do they shape your reality? How do they influence your journey? As we conclude, we invite you to share your thoughts and experiences in the comments and subscribe for more content on spirituality, personal growth, and the mysteries of life.